Oh, welcome to another throwback here on Throwback Gaming. I'm Johnny Gamewell, and I'm welcoming you to part 20 of our Doom 3 long play for the PC. That's right, the big 2-0. We have made it through the CPU processing, and now we are headed to main processing, and we have met up with Swan. We have seen Malcolm, his lackey, and they are both dead. Although we did not see Swan die, it is presumed that he is right fucked, and we are going to meet up with Sergeant Kelly, and apparently he's been corrupted, transformed, and now... We're gonna have to fight him. We're gonna have to kick his ass. We have finally returned to Sergeant Kelly, and we're gonna see what the hell happens. And yes, I am playing through this game some 14 years after its release for the very first time again. I did beat it one time after its release in like 2005, so some 13 years later, here I go. I want to see if the game held up, and it is fucking fantastic. So if you haven't played this game, play it. And if you haven't seen the other long play parts, go check those out. And even better, come check me out on Twitch, Johnny Gamewell. But, without further rambling from myself, let's continue. We are at the end of central processing, and like I said, we are about to head to main processing. Whatever that means. We're going to find out, that's for sure. I think we're going to process the death of Sergeant Kelly here. Let's, let's read the little captions. Central processing has a control system which reads process data for experiments. Or just going to regular data operates for the entire outpost of Mars. So I think we already read that actually. Okay, so here we go. Got that horrible music to start. Fuck. I am waiting for Oh yeah, Sergeant you. Kelly. Waiting to kill you. Sergeant Kelly. Oh shit, there's something that's not Sergeant Kelly. This little fuck nugget. That's what that is. Shit. GameCube. 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 Go for the GameCube. You gotta go for the GameCube sometimes, you know what I mean? Ooh, that fucking spider. Dude. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Dude, I don't like this. Yeah. Never kind enough to send you just one. Oh yeah, that's GameCube. Fuck those things. Fuck. Fuck, dude. I do not like this. But I feel compelled to finish the game. I, mean, I truly don't think I want to keep playing. Alright, I think I could use a fucking... Ugh. Oh, shit! Spider fucks keep spawning, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, here we go. The fuck nuggets. Ugh. No, sir, I don't like it. Oh, fuck. I look into your soul. Fuck. Fear. Yeah, you do. <laughs> okay. I think we got some Batmans. We got some Batman. We got some Batman, that's cool. Batmans aren't so bad. Yeah. Oh, shit. Dude, I gotta use the GameCube on him. Come on, come on. Get the fuck out of the way. Use the GameCube. Arr! You! No! No! Ooh. Use the fucking GameCube. Ugh. 
That was fucking terrible. But quick savable. He should have been GameCubed. I definitely should have GameCubed the skeleton. Okay. Son of a bitch. Oh, no, no, no. Come on. No, it's one of those. No. No. No, no. You stay away. You stay away, good sir. The Batmans will help me charge the GameCube, but... Fuck, oh, dude, here he comes, here he comes. Okay. He's got a couple Batmans with him. I think I'm just gonna use the fucking rocket launcher. to get up on your ass. Come on, use the rocket launcher. Ah, he's right next to me, motherfuck. Batman? Batman? Batman. Ugh, <sighs> Jesus Christ. GameCube on him. Jesus Christ. That is definitely screenshotable. For sure. Holy shit. Yep. Pretty badass. That's not going to catch the scope of it, but... Alright, here we go. Warning. Security bridge in motion. Oh shit, look at that thing. Dude, this is bad news. This is going to be bad. Almost as bad as that texture. Holy shit, that is an ugly-ass texture. Oh yeah, here we go. Come on. Skull fuckers, or... Fuck you, wow. Fuck, I could use the GameCube right now, I'll tell you that much. Uh, I don't know, storage. Okay. Yeah, that's always bad news. Damn it. Son of a bitch. I hate it when you when the bull rush fails. Oh shit, Nazi. Okay. I'm surprised it actually fucking worked. Oh shit. Dude. Dude! Dude. Holy fuck. Wow. And something's in here, but... Ugh. 
I don't want to pick up any ammo, or excuse me, any health, honestly, because I want to GameCube it. I'm just worried about some bullshit going down. Alright, we gotta... Yeah, that sucks balls, dude. Yeah. Bad idea. <laughs> that was a really bad, bad idea. I think I'm gonna have to quick load that, because I was just retarded. It was good in principle. But... Or an execution. So... I think I'm just gonna have to... Reload this, right? Because these assholes are gonna pop back out. Yeah. There's one. There's two. Again, I truly do hate to do that. It just takes the... The horror element that I am complaining about so much. <laughs> it takes it out of it. That is the point of the game, man. Okay, so... What am I gonna do here? I think I'll just throw these... ...and then GameCube the fucking demon. Dude, really? Fuck you, bitch. Throw the GameCube out, throw the GameCube out right now. Throw it out, throw it out. Go, go, go! Batman? Batman's coming. Batman? Batman. Oh, dude. Batman. One would hope that the GameCube would go for the... ...for the most powerful enemy, like the summoner in that case, but that's why... Just want to get up in his face. Okay, so that was storage. And that was good, but... I don't feel like it was wholly necessary. Alright, so what do we have? Yeah, we got some beasties, of course. Suck a dick. Go into the hellhole. Shit, nugget. Alright, so where do I want to go next? Central processing? So I came from the CPU bank. Go to the server bank. Nightmare fuel. There we go. Oh, yeah. Bitch. Is there another one? Yep, there is. The yellow. Use the GameCube. Use the quick save. Oh, fuck, Nazi piece of shit. You're gonna suck on the tip, aren't you? Did that get him? Seem to have killed him. Oh, maybe not. Hi. Sounds like there's another one, yeah. Alright, he's coming up. This cocksucker's definitely coming up. There he is. And now he's dead. He's fucking dead. Spider fox. Definitely sounds like there's an imp. 
in the vicinity as well. What I'm gonna try to do is maybe... Yeah, I'll throw a fucking grenade. Hmm. Where the fuck is it? Hmm. Okay, that's no big deal. That is NBD. Itch. <sighs> Fuck. Oh yeah, here they come. <laughs> Fucking nightmare fuel. I'm telling you. Those are not cells, no, there's a light. You're a little cocksuck. Here we go. Very nice. Bad things are going down. There's the second one. They always come in pairs. Not always, but I would always prepare yourself. And then there's always, not always, but again, expect. Expect two to always spawn and expect one to always be on your back. Okay, what the fuck is this? Is Turbo Turkey Puncher? Oh, hello. UAC research and design. The BFG 9000 is the most advanced Here we go. firearm ever designed. Fully self-contained and deployed as a handheld platform, it is capable of an excessive amount of fire. The BFG 9000 contains sophisticated friend or foe technology that discriminates targets in real time. Each projectile contains a small but very powerful computer core that actively maintains targeting and delivers a stream charge down each beam to soften targets before detonation. The detonation stage of the projectile is devastating. Targets within 15 meters of the flashpoint are not likely to survive. While not recommended for small quarter combat, the BFG-9000 is ideal in the field and against multiple targets. The only foreseeable defense is small arms ballistics. If the projectile is destroyed before exploding, the computer core cannot process the final fusion reaction, resulting in a less than optimal detonation. For more information, contact the UAC's Advanced Weapons Department. Well, wasn't that informative? Make sure everybody is good to go, everybody. I don't know why I always say everybody, I mean every gun, of course. Looks like we're good to go. Even the GameCube is packed. Very good, very good. And... Okay, ultimately this... Okay. I don't want to say this was fruitless, but I can smell Ugh. your fear. Yeah, I can too. It is palpable. Are these summoning fucks now? Okay, there's one. There's the twin, and there's the death. Okay, so now we have two more places to go. GameCube stacked in hand. Okay. I think 
actually we have one more place to go. Central processing. Security clearance accepted. Cool. I am most pleased. Yeah, fuck you. Come on in, bitch. Jesus. Alright, let's take a break. With the fucking PDA. Steve Toulouse. Storage problem. Okay. Got UAC MOV. That is hilarious. I feel like the GameCube is going to be needed shortly. There's a video disc for the BFG. Got some fucking rockets. This level's been kind of slow paced. And that tells me that it's leading up <laughs> to a very big boss battle. Soul Cube. What you see before you is a relic codenamed U1. Or simply Soul Cube. Yeah, I remember seeing that as well. Alright, shit is gonna go down, I can tell. They're being very generous with the health pickups. Oh yeah, this is it. See if I can get a screenshot. Or maybe not, maybe it won't go into a cutscene. Either way, alright, here we go. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. Okay. What is that? Dude. Oh my god. Wow, that was like... Instant kill. Oh. Alright, so I'll throw this- I'll throw the soul cube at it and... I don't think it'll be a- it, it, I can't imagine it's gonna instant death bosses, but... Yeah. I'm dead. Oh yeah, I'm fucked. Dude, this is gonna suck. <laughs> this is really gonna suck, Dick. I don't think the soul cube does anything. My guess. Dude, when he chases you with that fucking arm. Oh, that's awful. <sighs> Alright, here we go. Yeah, you gotta fuck him up bad. Dude, I'm not gonna... How the fuck am I gonna do this? Dude, holy shit. <laughs> God, I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat this. I mean... Mm. <sighs> fuck. Alright, I'm just gonna try... Try, try the lasers. I don't know what's causing that damage. I think that's part of the issue too, is I don't... What? Hmm. I don't know what's causing that, uh... Constant damage. Hmm. I thought I was stopping it. Is it that? Alright, so he's pretty static in his movements. Okay. It's gonna be painful. This is gonna be one of those classic... ...PC moments. Hmm. I'm gonna try shooting the projectile. Okay, so that projectile... ...it hurts you, like, when it's present. This is more like a puzzle boss. Wow. Looks like his head was hanging off. 
I don't know if that's a damage indicator or what, but I'll try that again. So it's like, I would say switch between the pulse rifle and the rockets, which requires you to take your hands off the fucking WSAD. I mean, I guess not if you're a fucking crew, but... It's right there, so... Oh, yeah. So maybe fire off... Hmm. Fire off rockets and then switch. It's like eight and four, maybe? That'd be my guess. So give off three shots. Go back to the rockets. Or go to the pulse rifle. Hit the fucking projectile. Switch. Release the fucking GameCube. And there's gonna be a second form, I'm sure. I'm gonna save this. Dude, I'm not gonna quick save this. Central server banks, too. Dude. BFG, baby. Or we'll blow up. Okay, that one actually wasn't that bad. I mean, knock on wood. <laughs> I just... It's ominous. Oh, he is just standing there. I can't imagine I only took two hits of armor. That's... That doesn't seem right. Okay, there's the stamina. Pick up. And there I was saying, I'm not gonna be able to do it, man. Okay, that's the entrance. Look at that fucking thing. Ugh. Disgusting. Ah. Like a tumor coming out of his chest. Something, something bad gonna happen here. He is not. Oh yeah, okay. There was this little passageway, of course. All right. I mean, was that Sarge? Something tells me that wasn't Sarge. It's like a mini boss. This half life style. Alright, can I drop? Looks like I don't want to drop down there. Look at that. The floor is rendered though. Very nice. It's not just an endless fog. Alright, anything horrible in there? Hmm. Quick save it. Can't imagine. Is this the end? Holy shit, it is. Wow, that was it. N. E N. Wow. That seems rather quick. Well, in any case, that does wrap up part 20 of our Doom 3 long play for the PC. I imagine that was Sarge, and we killed him, the poor bastard, Sergeant Kelly. He morphed into a freak, and what seemed to be an impossible boss was quickly defeated, and, uh, gotta love that in games. That's some good design, where you just, it's almost like a Dark Souls, where your first encounter, you're just like, holy shit, how am I gonna beat this? And then you eventually figure it out, and it's not that bad. Just like this game. Still not too bad after all these years. In fact, pretty fucking fantastic after all these years. But anyway, I digress. As always, thank you. Thank you so much for joining me here on Throwback Gaming. And stay tuned for part 21. I feel like we're whittling it down here. We are getting near the end of Doom 3. And of course, the expansion will follow shortly afterwards. But regardless, thank you so much for joining me here on Throwback Gaming. I am Johnny Gamewell. And I'll see you guys next time.